Hello everybody, Chris and Scott's Colorado Adventures. Today it's Rachel and Chris. Hi. Hi. And guess what day today is? National Wear Your Ears Day. Woohoo! Yep. We have a lot of ears, so we, we thought it'd be a fun video to show you all of our ears. Okay, how do you want to start this? Well, first of all, I'm going to show you this picture of Rachel. I'm going to show you a little. This was her first pair of ears. So cute. <laughs> Are you so little? <laughs> we do have those ears somewhere. I just can not find them. So. Yeah. In but, fact, she's got a few pairs packed away. But yeah. We're going to show you all of our most probably recent ears from the past three or four years? Yeah. Five years? I think when I really started doing the headbands is when I really started getting into them. Yeah. Because I thought those were super cute. And I think they're a lot better than the regular ones with the strap. As much as I love those because you can customize those, I really like the headbands. Yeah, they're fun. Yeah. This pair a friend of mine made and I wore them to Disneyland last year when we went. And I love Dole Whips, so that's why she made these for me with the pineapples. They're so cute. They are cute. We have yet to make our own ears, but I love that idea and I think that would be so fun for us to do. Yeah. Because you can get super creative with those. And as much as like the Disney Park ones, like how amazing those are, I think it is fun to have your own touch on them. Yes. Set of ears. It is. All right. Rachel, what are you wearing? Um, I am wearing my donut ears. So I got these last year during spring break. Um, I saw these and I had to get them because donuts, duh. Like, <laughs> and I think you can still get these in the park. I yeah, believe. I want to say that they still yeah. these ones, but I love them. Um, when I did get them, I was a little concerned. So they have, bring them up closer. So they have little sprinkles, like sequences. And I was a little worried that they were going to fall off pretty easy, um, but they've actually stayed on really well. So the quality of these are really nice. Um, yeah, they're they're cute. And they're super. I, I think love I wore the sparkly those. bow. I wore those. Yeah, I, I think I, you did. I steal her ears a lot. She does. <laughs> but yeah, no, I love these ones. I think they're so fun and girly, and they're just adorable. Yeah. So. These are not really ears. They're kind of like ears. Yeah. Um. This one we actually got from Claire's. So these were in the mystery ear pack. So they came out with a little brand where you could get like mystery ears so i wouldn't say that these are the best quality they are very flimsy they're and not authentic disney but they're cute no they are cute um i mean they are made by disney but they're not like from the parks from the parks they're very cute they're if you wanted to go sequency and you had like you know your mini fashionista like wardrobe <laughs> rocking these would be perfect for that um, yes, I like very the like, Yeah, but like I said, they're not the best quality. They are kind of fraying a little bit. Um, but it is fun to get like a mystery ear. I think that's, yeah. I think that's a great idea. I think that was super fun. I really like that, so. Yeah. These, Rachel got for me for my birthday last year. I did. And we went as Mousticators, so I wore this as part of my costume when we went to um, Disney for not so scary Halloween last year. We'll throw a yeah. photo in there. We'll yeah, have, we might actually just put that video in there. there. Yeah. All right. So I actually got these ones at the Disney outlet um, for probably like four bucks. They were- Oh yeah, those Disney outlets in Florida. Though, I wish we had some in Colorado because we would be there all the time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, I got these for super cheap. Um, I like these a lot. I have yet to wear them on like the 4th of July, but maybe this year. Hopefully things start going back to normal and we can outside and have a barbecue and do that type of stuff and wear my ears because when am I ever going to wear these? So yeah, I really like these ones. They're super cute. I feel like my ears are sticking out of my ears. <laughs> <laughs> these are Rachel's. Yep. I don't know when you got these. Um, I want to say those were actually my first pair that of the headband ears that I got. Um, that was actually quite a few years ago. We went for my, I went to Disneyland with my dad and my cousin for her birthday. And her sister bought all of us a pair of ears, and I wanted the simple, sparkly, you know, mm -hmm. mini ears. So they're cute. Yeah, very classic. I like those ones a lot. These aren't necessarily ears either. Yeah. Neither of these. Okay, so this is another pair that I actually got at the outlets. I 
still have the tag on them actually. <laughs> so I have not worn these out yet. Um, They're cute. Yeah. That's kind of a new style they have coming out. Yeah, where they have some of the cute little like ears for each of the characters. So this is Sully's. Um, I really like these. I actually have a Sully tail. So if I ever need Halloween, Halloween costume that's super easy and cute, mm -hmm. I can go with Sully. And yeah, you got those at the outlet for pretty cheap, I think, as well. Yeah. I don't know if it has like the actual price. I don't know. But mm -hmm. no, I got these for really cheap. Probably yeah. like two dollars. So yeah, I'm telling you those outlets, guys. These are Rachel's as well. <laughs> those are mine. Um I love those. I think that is just so cute because it's like the maid. From the Haunted Mansion. Yep, and it's got the cute little, um, with the bat, it's got the little Haunted Mansion symbol on it, and it is, I just love those. I think that is so cute. Like, that'd be such an easy Halloween costume too if you wanted to like, get an apron and, you know, go as one of the maids. I think that would be so simple. Very cute. That, and if you're not into like the big ears, because I know sometimes it can be a little hard, especially for my friends who have glasses, they're hard to wear. They like to fall off. Like, they do not. And I have such like a small head that they don't stay on. So I think just like the normal headbands are great too. Mm -hmm. There's another Haunted Mansion set. I'm not gonna put this on. Oh, I am because these are so cute. I have Okay. pandemic here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so do I. I got bored and braided mine. So these are two of the Haunted Mansion ears. So So these are the Sally Slater ears. I had to get these. So I have a Sally Slater costume. Um, a friend of ours actually made it by hand and I'm obsessed with it. She did such an amazing yes. job. We'll put a picture in the... Yeah. So we, um, Jake and I, we went as two of the portraits for Halloween and we did that for Mickey's Not So Scary. We had probably the most compliments I've ever gotten on a costume. Yes, they um, did. I just think because but Sally Slater, she hadn't been such a huge character, like that was well known. I mean, yeah, everyone knew her from the portraits, but no one decided to like bring her to life, I guess. So it was just super cool. And then all of a sudden she became this popular person and I was like, oh my God, I have to get those. Yes. So we got them. They're, these ones are so cute too because they have her little umbrella on the side. Like, I've it's never such that. a small little thing. Detail. Oh, it yeah. sure is. So those are great. Cute. Love those. And they go perfect with my costume. They do. So these ones I got last year when we went to Florida, right? Yeah. yeah. So I saw these and I had to get them right away. Um, <laughs> they actually glow in dark, so the little bus, they light up. It is, they're so cute. Um, the fabric is really nice. It's kind of like that felt. Um, but it has all the different designs on it um, for different parts. Like you have the caretaker, and then on the back you've got the oh, image and a cool skull. Um, so the side is actually like a leather type material, and then on this side it says Grim Grinning Ghost because that is just awesome. I love these ears so much. As you can see, on Mansion is probably my favorite. Yeah, it's, it's my favorite. It's so. really fun. Okay. These are some of my favorites. <laughs> oh, I know you love those ones. Um, so these are the Jack Skellington ones. Um, I love this movie. I didn't at first when I first saw it, um, but then I got more into it, so I had to get these as well. I like more of these darker ears, I think, you yeah. know, like the Halloween type. I think those ones are so much fun. These are her so. pirate ears that mm -hmm. I borrow quite a bit because I love the pirates. Um, I think I wore it Pirate Night one night on yeah. the cruise ship as well. Those ones are perfect for Pirate Night because yeah. especially, I mean, we have pirate hats, like the big ones with like the feathers and those ones are super nice too. But I love these ones because you're still incorporating Disney like with yes. Pirate Night because they're the Mickey ears and it's got the little hat and it's got the yeah. feathers and the, the flowers. I love those. I think those are perfect. Yes. Yeah. Both of these have little feathers, so that's super fun. All right, Rachel, I'm gonna let you tell them about these. Okay. They are called Swap. They came out for a while, and then all of a sudden they just stopped they making stopped them. making them. They're called Swap My Bow. Yeah. And so, so these are great. I love these. I this. think they were such a good idea. So you get the basic headband, and it comes with a bow. So here's 
and it has like the little bow on there as well. But basically, you take it and then there's little pieces to the headband that you can just slide it through. Like that. And then you just have your own mm -hmm. bow headband. So this was the one that it came with. Um, I'll show you some of the other ones then, that we bought to go on there. Yeah. So I am really disappointed that they stopped making these. I know, these are so fun. They were such a good idea. So this was one that I got at the outlet. So this is Dory from Nemo. Um, they're just so cute because they're so simple. Like you would never know. They're unique. Yeah, like it's so subtle that, I mean, you could think it's Dory, but you could also just like have it blue and yellow like to go with anything. So I really like that. So this was one of the bows that we got um, at the outlets. Another bow that we got at the outlets is Princess Aurora from Sleeping Beauty. This one's so cute. It's so simple. It's adorable. This one, I just, I think little girls would love these because they can wear their Mickey ears with their little back. princess dresses. I hope so too. But yeah, this one is so cute. It's yeah, so it's simple. So, yeah, it's got a nice heavy clip on the back. Yeah, so it doesn't like fall down or anything. Yeah, and it it's just slides scary. into the little groove. And there you have it. And then you're ready to your go. Bow. It's so easy to like switch out. Yeah. It just literally takes two so seconds. So you could just bring literally this and your bows and on your trip and you're good. You have one for every day of the week. Yep. Here's another fun one. This one's really cool. This is probably my favorite one that I have because it's the Haunted Mansion and it's Madame Leota because it's just like, it's awesome. Um, and then it's got the wallpaper on it. So it's just so subtle and it's amazing. These were such a good idea and I'm really just, dis really disappointed. That they but you got a bunch of cute ones. I do. <clears throat> This one is adorable. These are my tiki ones. I love these ones. Yeah. Had to get these ones for our trip when we went on the cruise because they're tropical. They're very tropical, yeah. And they're perfect for when you just like want to sit down and like have a dull whip and <laughs> hang out in the tropical hideaway. So yeah, I love Hopefully these someday ones. Someday we'll go to Hawaii. Yes. Yeah. And you here's will. another really cute pair too. Yeah, these are my They're easy to put on, I promise. So these are my Sully ones. They're kind of big, so. But this one's so cute. It's Sully and Mike Wazowski. So it's got both of them. Um, and much like the other ears, the headband that we have, they both have the little, his little hooks. Why am I, what are these called? Amp horns? Horns, yes, <laughs> horns, not hooks. Um, but I love it because it's both of them and they're together and it's just so cute friends for life so yeah this is probably one of my favorite Disney movies so I was really happy when I saw these because you have to get them if you love them so <laughs> yeah all right we're gonna show you a few of <clears throat> here's Jake's first pair of ears from 2017 just the basic yep see I love these because you can get them customized and you can have like you have a couple pair when you were little yeah I have a Tinkerbell pair that are it's, they're purple and they have Tinkerbell on them but fortunately I cannot find them that he got wow, a couple years, a couple last years year. ago. These are super cute. Yeah, those are super cute. Donald, it's their favorite, so. Yeah. Super cute. And then I think Scott got these pretty recent. He hasn't even worn these ones. Yeah, they still have the tag on them and everything, so. Or should be too. Yeah, those, those ones are, are pretty awesome. I do want to get the ones they have them in um, Galaxy's Edge, and they're the headbands with, you can get them with BB-8 or R2-D2, and they make noises, and they're just- They light up. Yeah. Unfortunately, they're a little bit too small for my head, but. All right. Okay. Rachel got these for Christmas this year. I did. I saw these. Okay. This is her last final pair. Yeah. These are probably my favorite, just because, oh my god, they're just, I love these. <laughs> she so, had to have them. So these are the Hipster Mickey ears. Um, these are like the original set with the string and you can wear them. Yeah, but, okay. So I just love these because a hipster Mickey, are you kidding me? <laughs> like you have to. But yeah. She wears glasses and they're just cute. They're adorable. <laughs> I mean, come on, he's got like a beanie and he's got the glasses. Like how can you not be on top of that? So yeah, no, I, I love these. These actually come with a certificate of verification. Yeah. So they were, I'm gonna mess up the name, but it, they were designed by Gerard, Gerard Marayama? 
correct me if I'm <laughs> saying that wrong, I know I am. Um, but yeah, they're a limited re release, so um, they are limited. Um, I'm not sure if you can or not, but I love these. They're just so cute. Are you going to actually wear them in the park? I don't know. <laughs> I like would, but I'm not, I just, I don't know. They're so, I just don't want to do like, them, you know, because these are probably my, all my favorite. They're so cute. I was first introduced to Hipster Mickey. We were actually, I think it was one of our first um, trips to Disney World, and we went to the Hollywood Studios. Yeah, I think it was the, on the... It was the... Aerosmith roller coaster. Right? Yes. And they had a little button of Hipster Mickey. And I was like, what? <laughs> Hipster Mickey? I'm obsessed. He had like a coffee in his hand and I just... With the glasses and the beanie, I was all on board. So... That's it. Probably one of my favorite designs of Mickey. Yes. But yeah. It comes in a nice little box. It does. It's... It's nice. It's like a big box. It's huge. Yeah. All right, everybody. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video today. We're kind of sticking to the theme of all of our favorite things and Mickey ears happen to be mine. Um, I do try to get a new pair every time I go to the park. So it's kind <laughs> of one of my little collections that I have. Yeah. All right. Well, if you did enjoy it, make sure you subscribe. Subscribe. And hit the big thumbs up. <laughs> Please. All right, we'll see you next time on Chris and Scott's Colorado Adventures. <laughs>